hi guys uh, welcome to our channel today we are going to see uh, how to calculate uh, the volume of water uh, most of the time we are given uh, the volume of the amount of water in terms of uh, depth uh, centimeter millimeter meter uh, when we are given the evapotranspiration loss of uh, uh, water by the crop uh, rainfall amount irrigation requirement uh, we are uh, most of the time given as a uh, depth of water so we need to uh, convert it into a uh, volume of water uh, so we can start with the density of water in order to find the relationship so uh, what is the density of water the, the density of water is one gram per centimeter cube which means uh, uh, one centimeter cube of uh, container holds one gram of water this is how the uh, the relationship is uh, so uh, one the volume is one centimeter cube uh, the uh, mass of water the, the weight of water is one gram uh, so we can convert it into a kilogram uh, per uh, centimeter meter cube to convert it, uh, we can use uh, we can write as uh, write it as one upon hundred meter times one upon hundred meter times one up upon hundred meter. This one can be written as this one because one meter is uh, hundred centimeter one hundred centimeter. So we can find when we multiply this uh, three. Uh, we can find 1 upon 10 to the power of 6 uh, meter cube which is still 1 gram of water uh, so we when we multiply uh, both sides by 10 to the power of 6 we can find uh, 1 meter cube meter cube uh, cube of uh, container holds 6 to the power of uh, 10 to the power of 6 gram of water this one can be converted into kilogram so when we convert it into kilogram uh, since one kilogram is 1000 gram we can find 1000 kilogram of water in one uh, meter cubic of uh, container so our container is now uh, became uh, one metric uh, cubic meter in, uh, instead of centimeter cube so this contains uh, if we consider it if we if we say uh, in terms of weight it's it's 1000 kilogram if it's in terms of volume it's 1000 liter so uh, we can say that one metric cubic meter volume uh, volume of a container can hold 1000 liter of water or 1000 kilogram of water uh, by using this relationship we can calculate uh, this example uh, we are given uh, 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 the, the hectare the area uh, the area of the field the depths of water uh, the amount of water is given as a depth just the depth of water in, in terms of evapotranspiration the water lost or used by the crop is uh, one uh, millimeter the area is one hectare so we can calculate the the, the volume of water here volume is uh, area times height. so the area is one hectare which means we can convert both of them into one unit so that uh, we can uh, easily calculate the volume so the, the area is one hectare which means 10,000 meter uh, square the the height of the water is the depth of the water is uh, one millimeter we can write it uh, one upon thousand meter because one meter is uh, th one thousand millimeter so when we multiply it we can find the volume of uh, the water as 10 meter cube meter meter cube or cubic meter so the container has to be 10 Metric cubic meter for the this amount of water to hold uh, for this crop uh, which is grown in one hectare so we we have this volume 
for the amount of water 10 uh, meter cube cubic meter uh, volume so uh, to convert it into uh, liter or kilogram uh, in this case we can just convert it into liter so uh, we found 10 uh, meter cube container so the container has to be 10 meter cube that's what we found so this metric uh, cubic uh, or cubic meter container will contain 10,000 liter because uh, as we calculated before uh, one metric metric cubic cubic meter container contains uh, or holds 1,000 liter of water or one kilogram uh, 1,000 kilogram of water so uh, when we multiply 10 by 1,000 uh, we can find 10,000 liter so if the depth of water uh, is 2 millimeter we can just multiply it by uh, 20 uh, if it is 3 we can just multiply it uh, by 30 so it's it became 30,000 20,000 so we can uh, calculate the exact amount of water uh, like this uh, because uh, maybe we need to find the amount of water so that we can uh, put it in in our container so uh, we can calculate it easily like this uh, sometimes uh, we are given uh, rainfall uh, data uh, in terms of depth in centimeter millimeter most meteorological stations are uh, giving us uh, rainfall data in, in uh, just a depth of water or in, in terms of millimeter so when we are given in millimeter we can calculate it and uh, convert it into uh, liter uh, so uh, suppose that we have uh, 10 millimeter of uh, rainfall amount within one hectare so uh, we can calculate it uh, as 10 times 10,000 uh, liter because we say that uh, in one hectare if the given depth of uh, water is one millimeter it is 1,000 liter that's what what we calculated it already so uh, we can multiply this 10 given amount of rainfall by 10,000 then we can find uh, 100,000 liter of water uh, obtained from uh, a rainfall within one hectare uh, we can also calculate the amount of uh, water uh, which is recommended by uh, uh, let's say our uh, researchers or uh, whoever uh, recommends so uh, let's say in, in for one crop it is uh, two centimeter of water uh, which is recommended uh, to you know to use for irrigation uh, then we can convert this uh, still it's for one hectare uh, we are considering one hectare so uh, if we are given one centimeter uh, depth of water which is for irrigation we can convert this into millimeter uh, by using this relationship one centimeter is 10 millimeter so we can we can uh, multiply this two centimeter by 10 uh, so that we can find the millimeter 20 millimeter then we can just multiply 20 millimeter by 10,000 10,000 is for one hectare if it is one millimeter depth of water so we can just multiply the depth of water by uh, 10,000 so that we can find the amount of water uh, in liter so we, we are uh, required to have uh, 2,000 liter uh, in our container to ir irrigate our area or one hectare area which is uh, the, the crop requires two centimeter depths so we can uh, calculate it like this uh, this is what i have for today uh, so uh, i hope to see you in my next videos uh, thank you by the way for watching our uh, channel uh, you can uh, if you like the, uh, the video you can subscribe our channel uh, thank you for watching again. Uh, bye. Have a good day.